Tualatin restaurant is fighting to keep from being forced to sell its land to make room for light rail. The owners of the Village Inn restaurant near Bridgeport Village say they've been told their land is likely needed as part of the Southwest Corridor Link. Our Lisa Balick is going beyond the headlines tonight, joins us live near Bridgeport Village. The local owners of this family owned restaurant tell me they learned just a few months ago from officials that there may be a taking of government taking of their land as part of that light rail project, the Southwest Corridor. And they say they don't want that to happen, so they are trying to fight back. They're putting together a plan to keep the location that's been a family owned business since the 1970s. This area is right off I 5 by Bridgeport Village. So far, the business has gathered hundreds of signatures and vocal supporters who plan to testify at upcoming hearings. Now, there have not been any final decisions yet on a proposed route, but tentative plans to place a park and ride lot or bus turnaround here, it's facing strong opposition. I don't like uncertainty, and I feel like, you know, we've got a, a great location here, and uh, I feel like it's a pretty good spot for us, and, and I know that our customers appreciate us being here, and I know they want us to stay. Now, meanwhile, federal funds for the Southwest Corridor Line have not yet been approved, nor a way to fund it locally like a bond. Plans indicate the Southwest Corridor Line isn't supposed to be up and running for at least another 10 years. First, they also, besides getting a route, have to figure out how to fund it. But the owners here say, look, now is the time to jump in, not after it's been approved. Live in Tualatin, Lisa Bay, like Coin 6 News. Thanks, Lisa. Here's some